Hey everyone out there, this is Tino, and I'm coming at you with another story. Today we're going to be talking about the Epic Games controversy uh, involving the cheaters on Battle Royale. I read a statement earlier about uh, about them addressing the, the cheaters and what they're doing about it. It was a statement uh, made by Nathan Mooney, the community coordinator, and uh, he answers a couple questions that are... It's, it's, very, it's very straightforward. Um, he says in the article... Let's be straight for a second. Nobody likes playing with cheaters. Not you, not me, nobody. Okay, that's no, that's a, that's a good point. Let's read on. We play PvP games like Fortnite Battle Royale for their competitive integrity. That feeling of outshooting somebody in an intense standoff and snagging that victory royale. And then there are cheaters, the 360 spin instant headshots we all know so well. Um, anyone who's played any shooter, any competitive game, be it a shooter, MOBA, Hero shooter, whatever, you know, to call out a few games, call out a few different games, Smite, Dota 2, Overwatch, Call of Duty, you know, the works. The the major esports players, we've everyone at some point that's ever played an online game has dealt with a cheater somewhere, be it a stream snipe, a stream sniper, or you know, if you're if you're a streamer, or just you know, aim bots or whatever. So we can all relate to that. Um, and it's very frustrating when it happens, especially in, in, uh, CSGO. I don't play that game much, but I understand that it's, it's quite an, it's quite an issue, uh, within that community. Um, I love the game. It's just not my cup of tea. Dota is more, but getting back to the point, what is Epic doing about it? They say, uh, he says to quote, to start addressing cheaters in Fortnite is the highest priority across Epic games. Okay. We are constantly working against both the cheaters themselves and the cheap providers. All right, uh, and it's ongoing. We're exploring every measure to ensure these cheaters are removed and stay removed from Fortnite Battle Royale and the Epic ecosystem. We don't want to give too many clues about what we're doing, but we are rolling out tools and will continue to do so. Thousands have been banned, and we have no plans to stop. So they've already. So that's the end quote. That's end of the end of that part of the quote. So they've already. Uh, taken action against thousands of players, which is good. Uh, nobody, again, nobody likes a cheater. It's plain and simple. Um, but they're also running into an issue that a lot of, you know, games like that have with cheaters where it's like, okay, the minute that you close one door, two get opened for cheaters. Um, they will just simply find a way, you know, that's why it took so long to get Pirate Bay shut down. I don't even think it is shut down, but my, the point still stands. It's it's not. It's just it's so hard to. It's practically impossible to curb cheating, not not curb cheating, but stop cheating. And and it seems like Epic is very confident in their ability to, you know, curb their cheating. Um, I don't play Fortnite. Um, if I were to play like a like an arena battle royale, I don't really know what the genre is for PUBG, but I would be I would play PUBG instead. Nothing against nothing against Epic. I just you know it's 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 not my style, and I would rather go with the tried and true. It's again it seems like a great game. I just you know I have my own feelings on you know that whole controversy. But that's another video. We're not going to talk about that right now. Maybe maybe soon. I don't know. We'll see. Getting back to the to the uh, statement here by Mr. Nathan Mooney. Uh, account progression. They'll be rolling out account progression, and he says on top of that, in the next several weeks, we'll also roll out progression. Account progression means that you will earn stuff as you play, and it's not just for fun. It will also help in the war against casual cheaters, and will give them less incentive to simply cheat their progression with a ban around the corner. For those persistent trolls, we'll be continuing to work on solutions. If you see something, don't stay silent. Please keep reporting this behavior and include any video or screenshots that you have. And then he signs it as the community coordinator. Um, so they're they're rolling out progression. Big shocker. Every game has it nowadays. I don't know if anybody's tired of it. Um, I know I certainly might be. I'm kind of on the fence about whether or not I care enough honestly uh but progression seems pretty neat it keeps a lot of people in the loop so on and so forth if you like it great if not oh well then go play PUBG. I don't believe PUBG has has uh progression i i, I might be talking on my ass i don't know if PUBG has progression comment down below if it has progression <laughs> so um 
it's good that they're actively taking a stance against this. I mean, you know, who wouldn't take a stance against cheating? But still, it's good that they're aware and that they're serving their community and they're, it's very straightforward. It's not that they're saying, oh, we're doing this and this and this. They seem very confident, very direct, very to the point. And that's something I think that a lot of game companies that have these kind of cheating communities should be working on just because, you know, it's a, it's a matter of volume over this or that. But anyway, I, it's, I trust Epic here. Epic's a great company. They have a lot of things going for them, especially because it seems that Fortnite has taken off. Um, so, I mean, that's pretty much all I have to say about it. I trust you, Nathan Mooney. I like your words. I like your confidence. Keep it up, and I wish you guys the best of luck. This has been Tino Krebins, and I'll see you guys in the next story.